We've got one of the rarest Pontiacs in existence sitting right here. It's a 1967 Catalina 2 plus 2 convertible. You know what makes it extremely rare? 428 HO motor under the hood and a four speed and a posi. This thing's been body off frame, nut and bolt restored, original number matching car documented by Pontiac. Now I've got some interesting numbers I'm gonna run past you real quick. In 1967, Pontiac made 420,000 full-size Pontiacs. 1,768 were two plus twos. Out of those, only 286 were convertibles. So if you follow me, 286 two plus two convertibles were made total with any engine, with any transmission. Out of the 420,000 full-size Pontiacs, only 385 had the HO428 with a four-speed. That's 0.0009%. So out of the 420,000 Pontiacs, how many were two plus two convertible with a 428 motor? This could be the only one ever built, probably the only one in existence. So you can go to volocars.com. That's where you can read about it. You can look at all the pictures top to bottom. There's copies of the documentation. <clears throat> That's also where you can find a price tag on every car we have for sale along with the monthly finance option. It's all at volocars.com. If you enjoy these videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the bell icon. You'll be notified when a new video is posted. But for right now, join me. Let's go for a spin. Yeah, it was a, one of the nicest gentlemen I've ever met uh, owned this car. Unfortunately, he passed away. This is from his estate. He collected big, full-size manual transmission cars. That was his passion. Uh, and this was a car that he bought years ago, <clears throat> had it completely restored at a shop that we use, a very, very qualified shop. Uh, so you can rest assured it was done right. Full body off-frame restoration. So underneath the car is all restored. The floors are all clean, rust-free metal. The frame, the chassis components are all clean, painted, look real nice. All the steering and suspension were completely rebuilt. The brake system was all rebuilt. Uh, the lines were replaced. The e-brakes hooked up. The fuel system was rebuilt or replaced. The tank was replaced. Uh, really nicely installed factory type dual exhaust system. Tucked up underneath, there were some turn down tips. <clears throat> you look up at the motor, it's all clean and fresh. This, uh, it is a high torque starter now. Uh, fuel pump looks new. It is the original four speed transmission. The codes line up for this car. It's a Muncie uh, and it has the safety track original rear end, which is Pontiac's uh, Posi. Uh, so underneath the car was completely restored. Now let's check out the body. Uh, this has been done for at least 10 years, maybe 20, uh, and it looks like it was painted yesterday. They do outstanding work. So the gaps are precise. When I say laser straight, I mean laser straight. It does have a hood tack. All this fits beautifully. Up here, the nose is all mint. Look how nice and square and flush. This is right on the money. These long panels, absolutely straight. There's no body work showing, there's no cracking, there's no bubbling, precise lines. It's all outstanding. Fits beautifully, laser straight, no bubbles, no cracks, no shrinkage, no issues. The body is pristine. Repainted its original color. I'm pretty sure it's Tyrol blue. The metal flake and color is laid out evenly. Uh, Clear coated, polished like glass, better than the factory new finish. Now this side of the body, absolutely as clean as that side. All the chrome was redone. You got the two plus two emblems. You got the arrowhead, the Pontiac, bumper show quality. Uh, the pot metal tail lights, I can tell, were restored. Few little pit marks still left. You know, they're pot metal. They're hard to get like new, but they look great. Side moldings, wheel well moldings are polished like chrome. The rocker molding looks like chrome. The window seals, gaskets, all that's replaced. Windshield's been replaced. 
Rally two wheels all restored with the correct lug nuts and caps, shiny trim rings. Tiger paw tires kind of go with the Pontiac. Uh, T3 original type headlights. The bezels look original. You reuse the original bezels. They're an 8 out of a 10. Bumpers all re-chromed. All looks beautiful. Correct antenna. Passenger side mirror. Convertible top's in excellent shape. There's pictures on our website's power top. Why don't we open it up? I'll show you that big 428. All right, let's see what's inside this ginormous trunk. Well, the trunk light works. Underneath is painted beautifully. It has the stickers. The jams are painted beautifully. New weather strip. Now the inside of the trunk compartment, all clean metal, spatter painted neatly and then clear coated for durability. Has the mat, the side panels, matching tire cover, the spare, new well liner. So nice clean trunk. Yeah, this guy was not a flipper. He had owned this car for several years. He, he was passionate about him. Uh, door jams are beautiful, weather strips, sill plates replaced. Look at the door panels. It's a pearl white. It's gorgeous against the blue. Door panels all new. The armrests, the window cranks all look new. The dash area, dash pad, everything's real nice. Looks like the factory speedometer and it has the gauges. I mean, there's nothing wrong with them, but they, they look a little faded. Uh, but this wood grain and chrome and the interior light, everything's really nice. I was having trouble with the glove box. There we go. Nice, clean uh, glove box compartment. Light works in there. Kick panel, vents, carpets, Pontiac reproduction mats. Has a rare four-speed only console in real nice shape with the Hearst four-speed. This is a deluxe wheel reproduction on a tilt column. Seats are all recushioned, rebuilt. Again, pearl white upholstery. The backs of the seats redone. Seat belts are excellent. Side panels, interior lights work. Inside the car looks pretty darn close to new. The visors and the mirror were replaced. Yeah, so the 2 plus 2 convertibles, what did I say? About 300 of them made all together. Now, they had a 428. This is the 428 HO, 376 horsepower. So that is the original motor, and they didn't have matching numbers back then, but we have the Pontiac paperwork that has the engine unit number on the paperwork that matches what's on this car. That's the motor this car was born with. Uh, and the dates and codes all line up as well. So it's all stock, you know, the hoses and, you know, wires and valve covers. That's all the way it's supposed to look. The engine bay is all painted nicely. You know, the fan cover, uh, spring clamp cables on a Delco battery topper. The battery's bolted down. It's got power steering, has manual brakes, wiper motors new. At the time of restoration, it was new. Shuts real nice. The doors shut real nice. This is just a nice quality car. I'm a real quality person. Restored at a quality shop. Again, rarity. It doesn't get any rarer than this. Not only rare, but desirable. All that goodness wrapped up in a convertible. Blue with pearl white upholstery. Uh, so an amazing car right here. It's a great value. It would cost more to restore it than what I'm asking. 
and go find one. Go find another one. You can go to volocars.com. That's where you'll find one. Salesmen can help answer your questions. They'll help get it delivered to your door. They'll help you finance it. If you enjoy the video, subscribe. Click on the bell icon to be notified when the next one's posted. Thanks for watching.